Hey everybody, welcome to my very first YouTube video. Thank you so much for clicking and showing your interest. Before we get started, my name is Annalisa. I am a mom, I'm a student, but whenever I'm not doing those more like serious responsibilities, I am doing a lot of crafting um, side projects. And that's kind of been the inspiration behind making my own channel. As far as crafts go, I feel like I do a little bit of everything, honestly, but I mainly am interested in knitting, crocheting, sewing and embroidery. I noticed that a lot of people are interested in the projects that I do and I feel like I always post the finished product instead of like what goes into it. I honestly just kind of have fun with it and figured I'd start filming a little bit more. I, so yeah, I think you can expect that a lot of my videos are kind of based around being a mom. You'll see a lot of my kids. Obviously, it's kind of hard to escape the kids. Then also of course uh, all those little kind of crafts and side projects that I do. Um, I really hope you guys enjoy these videos. Bear with me as we go along. I'm super new to this. This is like a major comfort, out of my comfort zone kind of moment. This is literally just me having fun and wanting to share it with you guys. So let's get started on talking about today's video. Um, I really wanted to buy a bed for my daughter and I found this crib, like a, one of those four-in-one cribs off of OfferUp for $70, which is not bad at all because it was in really good condition. I just didn't like that it was such a deep, dark color. And of course I wanted to go to like the complete opposite spectrum and do a really light color. So you're gonna see later on in the video just how dark of a color I was working with, which is why I went with two coats of primer to make sure that the color that I chose really be able to show up. So I'm just gonna kinda leave it at that and um, I'll let the video take over and you guys can see the whole process of everything that I did. Alright guys, so I finished the primer already and I'm now starting with the color. I'm using a brush first to get into every little nook and cranny that the roller can't get into because I don't want to like shove the roller into little areas and then have a bunch of paint, you know, like glob up right there. So I'm using the brush first. I'm going super light because I don't really want brush strokes in the finished, you know, product. And then I'm going to go over it with the roller. So like, do you guys see these this area right here? Can you imagine trying to get a roller in there? So that's why I'm using the brush. Have you already done this before? I have. I already. And what happened? I kept going. <laughs> Mom, watch out, there's a bunch of robots. Oh, is that what that's for? Yeah. See, but oh my gosh, I just got my... Alright you guys, so I finally finished painting the crib and then I went ahead and painted a bookshelf of hers that I found at like a thrift store kind of place for I think it was like $13. Since I already had all my paint stuff out, I figured I'd paint it. So I did like the little strip in the middle of gold and then I kind of messed up and I got some gold onto the sides so I ended up just painting it in the same color of her crib. So now all that there is left to do is just to install everything make it look nice, um, so yeah.
What are you doing? Okay, you guys, I think that's about as much as I have for this video. I didn't think that I would accomplish as much as I did, like the bookshelf and the chalkboard art. I definitely, that wasn't really in my plan, but it's, it was nice. It's a nice little touch. I'll go ahead and link all the products that I use in the description box, so go ahead and check that out if you're interested. And, uh, what? Huh? Um... Do you like your crib? It's okay? I did all that for for like, eh? Okay, so I feel like I covered everything. Um, so I guess this is goodbye. See you guys next time. Oh my god, you're still here?